Hey, good job. Hey, happy Sunday. That was, uh, it was exciting. It was exciting. It was coming, yeah, it was coming right down to the wire there. <laughs> Who survived? Greggles, Hi, Scorpio, and Shipwreck survived. And congrats, evil bud. Hey, Scorpio, on the, uh, on the fry. Yeah, happy time zone. In your time zone, it is my birthday. <laughs> so, so my birthday is tomorrow. I thought I'd kick it off with this. Well, so there was a few things that happened yesterday. So what was funny was, uh, so Comrade Quest raided me uh, yesterday. And I know he's a big Trekkie. And we were actually talking about this the new episode that was going to be a crossover with Lower Decks. And we were talking about that in the stream. Well, lo and behold, when I stopped streaming at 7 p.m., they released that episode. Now, the reason they did it was they were they were showing it to everyone at, at Comic-Con. And they said, well, they probably thought to themselves, well, if we show this, there's going to be a bunch of bootleg versions of this episode online. We better just release it on Paramount Plus on the same day, which is what they did. So we had gone out to eat to kind of celebrate my birthday a little bit earlier. And, and I'm like, what? We've got to go home. <laughs> so we went home and watched the new episode of Star Trek Strange New Worlds, which was pretty funny. I, I, I had pretty high expectations. It met them. I was hoping for more, but I think it was a, still a pretty funny episode. What do you think, Neil? It was all right. Yeah, I, I didn't think it was bad or anything like that. I, it, was, it had a little bit of heart, heart. like which is what the um, heart, uh, which is what uh, the, the Lower Decks has a lot of that. I like it well enough. Yeah. I don't get as excited about it as you do. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I've thought all the, there's been, with the exception of maybe one, well, I mean, none of the episodes have been bad this season. Um, no, no, it's, 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 they're doing well. Um, what about the, uh, they have put out such crap before that I yeah, always temper the, my expectations. The musical episode. Are you ready I'm for the musical episode, Neil? Not ready for that. <laughs> So they also announced yesterday that there was going to be a musical episode of Strange New Worlds. So, um, that's like in two weeks or something like that. <laughs> hey, Captain Jim Rayner! Welcome! Intruder alert! We were just talking. We were just literally talking about Strange New Worlds uh, Lower Decks uh, crossover. <laughs> what were you up to? Mario Party Superstars? How, how did your stream go? So speaking of uh, other trekkies, <laughs> it was well, it was it was a nice. Um, so my birthday's tomorrow, and so I was like, hey, "This is a birthday present for me from Strange New Worlds." <laughs> and so I was gonna show. Did I get? I don't. I didn't really get any trekky uh, birthday gifts, but I was gonna kind of show off some of my birthday gifts that I got. It was your date night. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome. Um, well, thank you again for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. I was lurking in your stream a couple days ago. <laughs> um, well, let, let's do... So one of the things I always do is I do a clip from... Uh, uh, from uh, Raiders, and so we're gonna pl let's play a, a clip real quick from uh, Captain Jim Rayner. All right, here we go. And everyone should go give him a follow. Wait, you're playing poker? Actually, kind of. Well, I guess you know that right makes now. sense. You either have an eight or an ace. Fuck it. What do you got? Oh, 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 baby. Oh, look at wow. that. Yes. Yes. Physically, oh physically I'm, I'm ill. I, I, I would be ill, too, if that happens. I, I am so <laughs> fucking unwell right now. Oh, my. <laughs> cool. So you had a poker night to... to uh, uh, you, you've been raising money for Extra Life, I noticed. Cool. How's that been going? I saw it, I saw it kind of in the corner of that... And did you reach your goal of a thousand yet? And yeah, I guess tell us tell us a little bit of uh eighty nine dollars from a thousand. Oh, well definitely 
uh i'll have to check i'll have to go come by your stream next time <laughs> i'm surprised you well that's kind of far from a thousand i was gonna say it should be one thousand seven hundred and one dollars should be the goal well so i am i am wearing i am representing today at least on my t-shirt and i was going to show off some of the gifts that so we did just so one of my daughters uh is uh not going to be here tomorrow night and so we kind of celebrated my birthday early <laughs> why does this screen i don't know why and it's so quiet too anyway uh so i was going to show off some of the gifts so first uh i got this uh i've got a blanket they they tend to I've gotten a tortilla blanket. I've got a well here I'll show I'll show that blanket here in a second. I got a, a pizza blanket for my birthday. They must think I'm cold all the time. Here, let me show you Captain Jim. Let me show you the well other one I got. I had to look for it. The, the Picard face palm blanket, <laughs> which stays in here for some reason. Um, <laughs> oh, thanks, Kai. Thank you for resubscribing. 22 months. <laughs> you have that as a magnet. That's awesome. Well, so here's here's another thing I got, very appropriate to Tears of the Kingdom. He should kind of hang out, maybe, kind of wedge him in there, so he he's kind of like peeking out. <laughs> um, I got I got some headphones. These are probably not going to be. I got these new headphones, these new nice Sony headphones, but these are really nice headphones. Um, I'm probably not going to be wearing these on stream, but I'll probably save them for like traveling or something like that. So that's pretty cool. Um, here's uh, I just got a series of shirts and y'all know I wear sh t-shirts all the time. So I thought some of these were pretty good uh, that Neil, Neil got me these or plus I forced to reunite them. <laughs> exactly. This one I thought was good. Back to the mushroom kingdom. And it's kind of, as you all said, a Back to the Future fan. So I thought that one was pretty good. <laughs> Thanks, Captain Jim. <laughs> Here's uh, introducing the floppy diskette. <laughs> I always thought where do we do we have any of these in here I don't think we have some floppy diskette uh, uh, coasters I also have these coasters too that are in here they look like uh, NES cartridges but they're just coasters I use I use those in here yeah I know it says remember 8 inch floppies I know um, I thought this one was good too uh, it's the Hyrule summer camp very appropriate for what i'm doing now archery horse riding dungeons <laughs> and last but not least oh i thought this one was good too this is uh it's kind of poltergeist and uh mario and peach so yeah anyway that's it. <laughs> yeah. She's here. Go towards the light, Peach. <laughs> oh, Kai wants me to do arcade mode. I haven't done arcade mode in a, in a while. But anyway, as always, we can take a break and play a game off the arcade machine like Dungeons & Dragons, just like Kai wants me to do. And thanks again, Captain Jim Rayner, for the raid. Um... What do you want me to play? Galaxian. <laughs> it's interrupting your streak. Oh, okay. I'd have to go look at that. 
<laughs> All right. So, TRG Kai wants me to play Galaxian in Arcade Mode! So, Galaxian, if you're, most of y'all are probably familiar with Galaga. You. <laughs> that way I don't have to go look at, look it up. Uh, you're probably more familiar with Galaga. Well, this is the precursor to Galaga and it's Galaxian. So you will notice it is a lot slower. A lot slower. Is it what is? Oh, because you want all the Galagas. Is that is that what the streak is? <laughs> all right, let me change the marquee. <laughs> oh if i it, how long does tekken win i i can play Gal galaga for a long time i am really good at galaga yeah i wanted to check and make sure the the category and everything changed because that's the new thing i added it did all right okay so let's play. So you'll notice it's much, it's not as fast and everything. <laughs> Arcade Paradise. No, what's Arcade Paradise? Okay. Oh, is it? A, it's a game on stream. What is it? It looks 3D. Is it just a bunch of arcade? Yeah. It's on Game Pass. Okay. He's giving control over Dad's laundromat. Oh, okay. So it's a game. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I'll have to check it out. All right, so let's play. Let's play some Galaxian. Yeah. Galaxian. They're coming right at me. That was terrible. Obviously, I haven't played it in a while. You'll also notice that score inflation has not hit Galaxian at this point. It not it had not been a thing yet. <laughs> Are you getting a call? Oh. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's play another game.
I am not used to this game. Dang it. Oh well. Let's try it one more time.
Ah. <laughs> Eleven nine twenty. Crushed it. <laughs> it's funny how it took me. It took me a little bit. Uh. Yeah, it just took me a little bit to get into the zone. <laughs> get in the zone. Get in the zone. Auto zone. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Let me update that high score. And now you have them. I guess you have all the Galaxians. Galagas and the Galaga 88s. But I just crushed it. I doubled it. I doubled the score. Beep, beep, beep. And a seven, twenty three, twenty twenty three. All right. Update. All right. Yay. Oh. Let's. Oh. <laughs> Did, oh, I was going to say, I thought Tears of the Kingdom decided to give up on us there for a second. It's like, are you going to play me? All right, so I thought in this time we would just uh, look for tears. So we're going we're gonna to look for uh, the, um, I don't know, they're called, I call them crop circles, the, the, the artwork that's in the, in, in the, uh, on the ground. And then there's like a little pool, and then you get a memory from it. So I figured we would, uh, we would do that. We are looking for... This, there's something this way. I don't like that over there. And we're going to stay away from him. Is this a... Huh. <laughs> well, welcome. Welcome, Dimples. It's such serene music in this game. Uh, most of the time. Most of the time? Unless you're fighting something. Unless you're fighting something. I just meant when you're wandering the countryside. It's just like... You, what, the music I find most con disconcerting is the yeah. is the riding a horse music. Oh, I didn't really notice that. It's like this aimless piano tune. Yeah, okay. You know the music I'm... <laughs> oh. Facebook is showing me the memory of them doing sing-along on that airplane. Oh, I'm sorry stuck on the tarmac for hours yeah the playthrough is going well it's you know it's this i've been calling this game a tam team time vampire time bar time fire anyway i'm vampire because it just seems like i've i don't know I, this is the 16th stream i think and it feels like i've just started I'm gonna go around this way. I guess that's where we're headed. Is that a shrine? It's not a shrine, but it looks like a fairy. I, I you know what? I will, uh, I'm gonna mark it. More wolves. that prime meat <laughs> I 
What is that? Oh, it's that painter guy. Uh-oh. I gotta help this guy. We've been helping him. I I've been enjoying the game. Uh it's it's very much if you liked uh Breath of the Wild, you will definitely like this. Alright, so I don't know if you've if you've played this or not yet. Let's um this is kind of my standard thing with this guy. Oops. That isn't what I want. Yeah. My standard thing with that guy is yeah, to Neil, run the fuck past it. Yeah, Neil, Neil standard with this guy is to run away. But uh, we will not do that. We will help him. This is how I think we're going to help him. If I did this, I'm going to attach it at an angle like this, which is kind of weird, but, but I'm thinking it will slide. Oh, I thought it would slide right under there. Here, watch this. <laughs> I don't know if this is a good idea. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. Right there. That's what I wanted. There. Look at that. See, that's going to hold it. Right? Maybe. Currently it's... on the fire temple? Cool. It could slide. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. But it could slide either way. But we'll see. Let's try Let's try this. I have some ideas if that doesn't work. Mm. Cool. So I finished all the temples. Um, and now we're kind of going through and getting more of the lore through um, the different patterns that are on the ground. The tiers, I guess, is what they call them. All right, so let's let's see what happens. <laughs> yeah, totally did not work. Um, I don't. That seemed sus there. All right, so here, let's try this. It didn't touch the ground, would it? Yeah. <laughs> Let's, um, all right, so we're going to do this again, but we're going to do it like out here. Here, and let's, hold on. Let's square it up. Get under there. Oh. I think you need some more. Yeah, well, you know what? I think I think what's wrong is. Uh... I think what's wrong is you didn't run past it. it. What? I think what's wrong is you didn't run. Didn't past run past it. it. I mean, you can't complain about this being a town vampire and help this guy. It's one of the other situations. Well, so what I thought about it is if I could take some of these things here and I was thinking if I could um, like angle these here. I had two of them. Here's the other ones. Like that. In fact, we could watch this. Ooh, I have an idea. This thing ain't going anywhere. What if I... Look, I can go through it and attach it like that. <laughs> I, I have totally locked it in place. All right, dude, this is, this thing ain't moving. Huh. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> I've essentially locked it in place. There's no way it's moving. How is he standing? Yeah, I will get the amiibo out. You know, I forgot the amiibo yesterday. <laughs> oh no, I I have not checked. I have I have it so it it, it mails me uh, when I have something in my PO box. Uh, has it arrived? I'll check it tomorrow. Is that a hat or is that his hair? I think it's his hair. I never figured that out. Oh no, it's his hair. Yeah, he's got he's got an interesting bowl cut. Got like a deep bowl cut. <laughs> I like how the backpack is way bigger ah! than that. <laughs> It's like one of Ooh, those. He gave Korok. me a bomb flower. Ah. It's like one of those Koroks. <laughs> okay. I'm so tired. I can't move. Oh. Soldier bow. I don't know if I need a soldier bow. Well, I guess I could. I mean. Well, I guess I can place this, this one. Okay. It was a moose. Down in there. Uh oh. Thing. Hmm. I will, uh, Matthew J, I will check. Here, I, I can check real quick. Do, do, do. I can sign in to my account. Let's see. Do, 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 do. does not say I have received anything. So. I can go, I can check though. Wrong zip. Oh, okay. That shouldn't matter, though. I wouldn't think. I remember this thing from last game. So pleased that you've come here as well. 
to be honest, Lady Impa deduced that there is something related to the geoglyphs here. It took some effort for us to get up here, but we managed it. But the Lady Impa grew impatient. The moment I took my eyes off her, she went deep into the temple all by herself. Once I finished mooring the balloon, I planned to hurry after her. All right. Hey, Pass. Guess we're going in, too. Oh, look at that. I got that. I got that. <laughs> you see how I put the... I put it through the... Uh... Oh, nice. Stop. Oh, stop. Weapons are so... Hey, Zab. Weapons are so precious, you don't want to destroy them in any way. more of them. Where's Empa? It is going up well. I guess we have to just go deeper into the... Fire arrow. Impa, we're here to rescue you. Ooh, a ten arrow pack. That's better than gold. I guess she's... I don't know where she's at. Oh, I guess there's up. 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 Oh, shit. Oh, hopefully I can climb over this. Nope. Don't worry, I can scale the wall. Spider Link, Spider Link. Oh. Are you climbing? Uh, the temple. This is the, the forgotten temple. Oh. You, know, you probably forgot about it because you know it's forgotten. I've I've forgotten who I am. Yeah. Oh look, there's a temple. Amazing. You mean a shrine? That's a shrine. But we're so in the Forgotten a, Temple. You said there's a temple. Like, yes, you're in it. <laughs> but there's a shrine. 
Is that Empa or is that a lampshade? Yes. <laughs> Oh, Link, thank you again for your help with the balloon. I believe there is something related to the geoglyphs somewhere within this temple. I'm searching, but so far it has been in vain. The chambers here are enormous, so it will be a difficult task at best. Where could it be? Well, let me go do this so that I have a place to uh, teleport to. Building blocks. I guess the next one's gonna be horrendous. I wonder if wa if they don't like water. <laughs> he didn't like water. <laughs> oh my my bow broke. I got a broken bow. Ooh, I'm glad I broke that open. I could use rupees. And then the other one is nothing. Nothing! That one's metal. Okay. Let's see what we gotta build in here. Oh, it's much more complicated. A three by three square. What do we got here? All right. Let's try. Let's try putting this on this corner. Probably gonna end up being more complicated. That. that. And I can already tell this is not gonna work out. Well, maybe. This is not going to work. What if I put 
this. Oh, did I just pick up both? Oh, I didn't. I didn't realize I, 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 I stuck them together. I didn't mean to do that. I was like, why? I was like, why does this look so weird? What if I did that, and then I did this one is. This one is a complex shape. So. That. Which is not going to work out either. Because that. Yeah, no matter what, how I put this in, it's going to. This won't go like this. Okay, it does go like that. And then... <laughs> and then I hit it with my stick. Oh, shit. That will work. These, these snap together. I have 3D per perception skills. Oh, I guess we never found the chest. Oh well. lights do I have? Oh, I have four. We'll wait. Okay, so, so you're saying it was like, keep going. Going deeper into the shrine. I'm gonna be like, I need some mushrooms. Ugh. Oh, look, it's a giant. A giant, uh, yeah. Is this the map room? Do I need the staff of raw? see that's cool it is like the map room committed to memory ah ah this place Ooh. lady impa let's head down we must investigate up close Yeah, upon the walls. Those not geoglyphs? Hmm, what could this mean? Uh, hmm, 
I believe the one we saw first was the geoglyph on the left edge of the wall. As for the next painting, mm -hmm. according to the floor map, it is near Rito Village. Oh. It seems the locations of the other geoglyphs from the wall are marked on the floor map as well. Yeah. I can hardly believe that my eyes behold who could have guessed that this ruin still held such secrets. It is said that the geoglyphs appeared all over Hyrule during the upheaval when Princess Zelda went missing. Hmm. How are they connected to these images here? There's no time to dwaddle. Dwaddle. Let us hurry and investigate the remaining geoglyphs. Mm. Oh, Lady Impa, perhaps you should rest a bit before such a trying journey. Oh. Link, if you happen to see our geoglyph during your travels, I urge you to investigate this matter as well. If more strange visions are waiting at the geoglyphs, just like the ones you already experienced, well, perhaps they will provide clues that could lead us to the Princess Zelda. All right. Six geoglyphs left to investigate. All right, so did that? So did that mark them on my maps now? I see the ones I've I've seen. I need to commit these to memory. Oh. Somehow make a copy of the map. Thanks. <laughs> What's this stone say? A tear with a tear. I can think of is to take a picture. Images here that resemble the giant pictures now found on the surface of Hyrule. Could it be that this is a place that's somehow connected to the ones that left them? Oh. You could investigate, intend to investigate the occurrence. Perhaps you should somehow make a copy of the map. I feel like that's what I just did. Is there a trick, Neil, to making a copy of the map? Like, so it appears on my map? Uh, it does not ever appear on your map. Oh, okay. Uh, I took a picture of it. Basically, you have to take a picture of it. Did you ever get your Purapad upgraded? No. It works. Okay, so does the Purapad 
uh, have a, oh look, there's stairs. I climbed in their stairs. Um, it has a camera. Oh no, like, I have I, a, I have the camera. Oh, oh, you do. Okay. Like yeah. I just show, I just showed you the camera. Yeah, you uh, basically you just have to go between that and then the map and figure it out. Okay. But it's still helpful. Yeah. Oh, you know what? After you go visit it, they show up on the map. <laughs> yes, and I have I've done that. Okay. Ah. Let's go up. Well, so where are we? We're here. Is there any in the left? There's two. Let's go this way. Although, if it's going to start raining, I have a feeling we're going to start sliding down this. Yep, there we go. Yeah, that's kind of what I was going to do. <laughs> I was trying to figure out, like, where's the closest tower? Oh, look at me. He's going to... I just want to pick up my arrow. Now we should eat like kings. Raw gourmet meat. Away with you. I don't want anything to do with a world ruined by gloom and ruled by monsters. It's cramped in my flower bud, but better than out there. 
I'll keep my blessing of clothing enhancement to myself until I hear the sound of a horn bringing some lively music into the world. I'll never go outside again. I moved here to be near a stable or near enough away so I could grace more travelers with my blessings. But now, until I hear the sound of a horn bringing lively music into the world, I'll never go outside again. Hey, Justin. Uh-oh. Must be too cold. Uh-oh. Too cold. Too cold. Ice, ice, baby. Too cold. Too cold. Where are you going? Why are you running away? Did you just set a horse on fire? Did not oh. set the horse on fire. Oh my god, he set a horse on fire. Now I'm gonna set this horse on fire. <laughs> that bitch is on fire! What is, he? is he on like a little pony? It's like a little miniature pony! Oh, I want it! I want it! Is it a burrow? <laughs> Or maybe it isn't a miniature pony. No, it's just a regular horse. It's weirdly marked, though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Oh, look, there's a shrine. You didn't see that before? No, I didn't. I've seen it like three or four times since you've been in doing it. Oh, here they come. <laughs> Smacked right in the face. Oh, it's a bear! I didn't know they had bears. Yes, they're bears. Yeah. You only see them in the cold areas. What if I were to hit it with a water to <laughs> But it would be wet. But it would be okay. Would it be okay with that? It would be a wet bear. Oh, would it be a wet bear? Okay. This runs away. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Who's, who, who did that? Oh, thank y'all. They're like, fuck that. We're gonna, oh, we're gonna kill this off the rock for you. <laughs> Yeah, right. yeah, when you get them all, they're great. <laughs> all right. Uh, I don't know. Are you hungry for birthday cake yet? Sure. Or should we wait a little bit? I guess we probably need to because the girls uh, want to go to bed. All right, let's take a quick break. And play some Fry's Quest. Exclamation mark join if you'd like to play some Fry's Quest. We're going to go have some birthday cake. Hopefully Izzy hasn't fallen asleep. <laughs> any new any new players or should I unlock it? I'll give it a few more seconds. All right, if you played last game, you can go ahead and come on in. Welcome to Neil's Deals. Where else you gonna go? Boo, boo, boo. I just wanted to give, you know, give a chance to those people who didn't play last time. Just in case they want to play. All right, Whiskey Smash, this is the first time you've played. You have 22 gold. You will want to buy a weapon. You could buy the hammer, in which you would do exclamation mark buy W2. Or you could buy you could buy the stick if you just wanted the stick. And you could then buy it like a shield, which would be A1. So that's how you do it. So the first column is exclamation mark buy A and then the number. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
The second column is by W number. And the third column is items. You only have five hit points at this point. I don't need a potion, so I wouldn't worry about that. Yes, and enemies are designed to attack higher level characters first. So you should, uh, you should be okay. All right, so now you only have seven gold left. You can't even buy the stick. So my suggestion would be <laughs> is wait. <laughs> wait until the next. Action. Wait till the next. You'll get more gold after this first wave. And then the store will come back. <laughs> Just hide behind your shield. You can still punch uh, with a shield. <laughs> And you'll kind of coast with these other players. And uh, soon you will be level two. Out, kiddo. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. See you in a second. Having a special today. Ah, uh, nothing. You all deal too much. I need to raise these prices. Ready for battle. Ready for action. No, we aren't calling those Neil's heels. Ready for action. Ready for action. Is this gold real? Ready for action. Ready for action. Ready for battle. Ready Good for battle. Good luck. You'll certainly need it.
have it a special today. Hey! Uh, nothing! Ready for battle. Ready for battle. It's super effective. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for action. Ready for battle. Ready Time's for up. action. Have fun watching the floor. Full of birthday cake. <laughs> Thank you. Although I, I did kind of choke on the birthday cake. <laughs> we had to have tall glasses of milk with the birthday cake. Uh, no, you can't only heal yourself. You can't heal. The potions only heal yourself. Yeah. It was a it was a yellow sheet cake topped with a chocolate fudge icing that I make from scratch, and of course sprinkles because it's a party. Yeah. <clears throat> One day I'm gonna run out of this. You're gonna run out of sprinkles? Yeah. I doubt that. I've been using the same that same the jar same jar sprinkles, sprinkles forever um, since all I've known you. For almost 10 years. The whole time I've lived here. I and mean, I had that jar for years before. That. Yeah. <laughs> it was really good. 
Well, we I, we I, spared you I, eating it on stream. I do use I do use a, a box cake mix, but I I doctor it up. Yeah. It it is no longer a box cake mix when I'm done. <clears throat> I will say that this these oh well so so box cakes mixed for years uh, were 18 ounces and now they're only 15 so I add back I have a mix of stuff that I add back that brings it back to what was originally the size I usually add some sugar to it I do add an extra egg. Uh, I, I I split the fat between oil and butter. And I use milk instead of water, and I put a bunch of vanilla into it. I think we can... Justin's the only one who didn't use his potion, so I think we can blame Justin. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't add pudding mix, uh, uh, but the but usually those cakes now say like putting in the mix. <laughs> you were happy to be included, Whiskey Smash, in the uh, in the defeat. <laughs> I'm currently still working on hair, so that you could customize the character's hair. So. Uh, I don't know. That's where I'm at. I've been there for for a while now, for weeks. <laughs> I need to work on it. <laughs> Courage to fall. Okay. Okay. That. Oh, interesting. You do jo German chocolate. Hold on. Uh, mixing the icing in with the cake. Hmm. Hey. <clears throat> oh, look at that. Oh, there's a bug. You can see the lasers through the through those blocks. Maybe it isn't a bug. Well, I don't know what to do here. Oh, I do know. Go back, go back, go back. Frosting I make is a, a a cooked frosting. Well, not strictly cooked. Uh, like it's not like a boiled frosting. You do put everything in a pan and. Oh, thought that was such a good move. Well, I love coconut cake. Jason buys me one. <laughs> I do. I don't make it. <laughs> it's fine because he found a good one. I found a place that makes good he's ones. He's paying a lot for it, too. I know how much it costs. <laughs> I haven't had German chocolate cake in a long time. 
That's funny, I don't think they have that at the German restaurant. Did they? Yeah. Although I think that that is actually named for a German brand, a, a chocolate named German's Chocolate. I don't think you have to wet them to make that work. No, <laughs> I just do that because because I can. Oh, it requires a key. Oh, did I just go up here? Well, that was boring. If I could, well, I just I need to find. There's got to be a key somewhere. Got to be. What's interesting is this. How do I get?
Hmm. Well. What am I missing? Didn't get spaghetti on me, but I got the icing on. You got icing on you. <laughs> I had stain remover. How does somehow get down there? Hmm. There's got to be a trunk somewhere that has the key in it. Yeah. Somehow I missed something. Did you check that trunk? Yeah. It's already been open. Oh, okay. I had arrows. arrows. <laughs> hey! Right. Chicken stew! It's a chicken stew raid! Welcome, everyone! How's it going? Welcome. What were you up to? Golden Sun, the Lost Age. Nice. <laughs> How's it going? Welcome, everyone. How was your How was your stream? It's a chicken foot raid. <laughs> I'm doing well. Doing well. Yeah, we're just kind of wandering around this uh, shrine trying to, f to figure it out. Well, thank you so much for the raid. Yeah, we're playing Tears of the Kingdom. I've 
I don't know how much you know about Tears of the Kingdom, but I'm mean, I, who knows how much longer I have in this game. That's, I guess, the problem. <laughs> but thank you. Thank you for trusting your community and bringing them all over here. Yeah, we're just kind of chilling out and playing some uh, Tears of the Kingdom. It's a chill vibe tonight. Um, for all of my uh, viewers, go give uh, chicken stew a follow. <laughs> cool cool well thank you i'm glad 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 we had uh had you you had the chance so what i like to do is play a clip so we're gonna play a clip from chicken stew i was thinking more along the lines of kesha boots well, here's golden sun right here x charlie xcx boys what is what this on words i'm not a bottom <laughs> I'm not a bottom. <laughs> That's the series Murray wants to redeem. Oh, when you get the points. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> to your standards, Justin. Nice. <laughs> Game Boy Advance. That's what it looks like. Yeah, that, that kind of... Um, it was either PlayStation or Game Boy Advance that had that kind of where you could have that whole texture 3d thing movement well i got oh so for those of you who've been here so i got a psp um i finally did i got a new battery the new battery's working i got the cable working that i can hook it up to stream so we can start playing some psp games now on stream so that'll that'll be a nice addition uh, when we get to i know i have a i i have a, a kingdom hearts psp game i gotta get to so you are, you are lurking? Well, welcome, one of four. <laughs> Hope you didn't do it well. Well, thanks. Thanks again for the raid. And so I'm I'm sitting here trying to figure out this, this shrine. I don't know where to go. I must have missed something. But let's go back. Let's somehow go back out here. Yeah, it's well. It says like, uh, let's either to so like when I play the on the DS or the 3DS. Sorry, the DS games I have to emulate, but the 3DS games um, I can stream from the device, and that's actually on the device and on the on the PC, and so I can I can I can play those directly. But yeah, I'm looking forward to playing those. Now let's take a look here. What are we, what are we missing? Okay, here's the beginning. We came out here. You had all the cables. Yeah, I I got some cables now so that it converts it to HDMI. Over here? No, that's just over there. Hmm. Unless there's something off the edge here. No. how I, I tilt my head as if that's going to help me in any way. <laughs> I know. That's really going to help me. It's a flat, it's a flat game. <laughs> There's no way me changing 
doing this is going to do anything. <laughs> when you enter the shrine, it says, don't be afraid to fall. Hmm. I believe that's what it said. Courage to fall. Which I thought it said courage to fail. Which that's why I thought maybe I fall here and I like break through the 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 thing, but Now, I have been thinking about that. The courage to fall. The only place I can think of to fall would be like... Out here. Right? <laughs> Which, that would not be the right, right move. Oh, no, no problem. Ha Thank you so much for the raid. Hope you have a good week ahead. Hmm. Try this again. We're going to try this again. This, it's prompting me to dive. Oh, fuck. That hurt. It's prompting me to dive. That looks suspicious. That looks sus. But maybe not hit, hit my head like that. Oh, thanks for following. Thank you so much. Right, let's try it again. No, oh, that did not work. That did not work. Unless there's something... Two year, the longest two years, six months of his life. <laughs> exactly. actually never hit a laser but Neil told me that when you hit lasers the floor opens up it's true so I didn't think about I didn't think about hitting the lasers because I've never hit a laser <laughs> did you just hit one well no it's because in the shrine you're supposed to hit oh I can't hey, Murray I can't remember all these shrines blend together moving all these stupid balls Balls. Good morning, Murray.
Yes, we watched it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was good. Is this just gonna hit the wall? Well, putting the ball uh, on the spot you're supposed to stand on probably wasn't the best call. <laughs> hey, it worked. I mean, it doesn't matter. What did you think of it, Murray? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, if you're a fan of Lower Decks, it was it was very Lower Decks episode. They did a good job of blending it. I don't know why I'm watching this. I was thinking about Lower Decks <laughs> or, or, or uh, Strange New Worlds. Monster tips. Just the monster tips. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, there we go. Your story is really something. Mind going through it again? Just to make sure I have all the details right? Oh. Sure, no problem. We've been taking care of a very rare animal for Princess Zelda, a golden horse. But the poor thing ran away from our stable. Mm. Hmm, Princess Zelda's horse vanishing like that is a pretty big story. But tell me again, why'd that horse run off? Oh. That's the troubling part, isn't it? When it happened, I'd finished tending the horse and was talk, uh, taking a bit of a rest in the stable. Then that gentle creature began making terrible sounds, neighing and bucking around so hard, it shook the stable. So you went outside to see what was wrong, didn't you? Mm. Yes, exactly. And there she was, Princess Zelda. After all this time, she was right in front of our stable. But then the princess came closer, and the golden horse thrashed harder. Oh. Then the animal broke free and bolted away like nothing I've ever seen before. I couldn't help s staring at that crazed creature. And when I looked back at the princess, she was just gone. It happened so fast. Hmm. Oh, you lost sight of the horse and then Princess Zelda vanished on the spot. That's all strange from start to finish. My little sources tipped me off about this, but I have to say, I thought it was going to turn out to be nothing much. Hey, partner, you're here. I should have known it would, was, was you there. Just look at you tiptoeing up like this and making your ear in, uh, getting your ear in. You've got the makings of a real reporter. Oh. oh, is this someone else from the newspaper? Oh, That's right, new partner. Plenty of gusto, a lot of promise. Would it be all right if he listened in? How p uh, now, please, tell us anything else you can remember, anything at all. Part that really bothers me is the poor animal acting that way. That horse truly loved the princess. She rescued it and protected it. She do doted after it. But the horse was terrified, and for the life of me, I can't understand why. Yeah. Princess Zelda is known far and wide for her compassion. I can't imagine our princess being terrified at all. Terrifying mm -hmm. at all. Hold on. I think I, I did catch the briefest glimpse of the princess's face. I thought I couldn't have seen that right, but she had such a cold expression. She's been full of warmth when she's been here before. Maybe the princess was furious that I let the horse get away. Oh. I really should find that animal and bring it back here for her. 
case of the missing horse. But that poor horse galloped north and never looked back. It's probably frozen to death. I'd go in search of that steed, but that huge monster was flying ar around up north. It's far too dangerous for me. The best I can do is just keep the horse home here in the stable nice and clean just in case it returns. I just hope someone finds that sweet creature and brings it back here safely. All right. Uh, here's the... Hello, hello, I know you, Traveler. We've had a delightful development. Look, I mean, listen, it's Eustace. He and his horn are back in our troop. It's heartbreaking to think that the poor fellow getting struck in, stuck in a hole on the way to Rito Village. Oh, yeah, I forgot we rescued him. Note to self, Eustace doesn't get to drive the cart anymore. But I'm glad he's out of his funk and fit as a fiddle. Eustace's horn will blow the stable's trotters back on course. Oh. I'm curious, did you stop by to visit the Great Fairy in these parts? Yeah, yeah. Yes, indeed. The Great Fairy M M Mija settled close to Snowfield Stable. Yeah, 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 I was just there. Can you see it through the snow? Alas, the Great Fairy is hiding inside her flower bud. She's too frightened to come out, just like her sister at Woodland Stable. This fairy, great fairy always liked the timber of Eustace's horn, so I thought to calm her nerves with the soothing toodles. I'd like to depart for the great fairy's bud straight away, only one small hitch. Our breezer's roof is broken, so we'd be at the mercy of the elements. Just look at that snow falling. We might fall ill if in such weather, and how could we perform at our best then? I did try to attach a roof to Breezer. Alas, I couldn't reach high enough to do more than set up some posts. If we can get a roof on Breezer, our performance for the Great Fairy is as good as canceled. That's, that's easy. I mean, does it have to be a fancy roof? I mean, I could... I could do kind of like a... a steepled roof. I, I do, I do run. I choose not to run. No, I, I, I have run. Here, I'm gonna hold. Yeah, I taught, I taught him to run. Yeah, he day. taught, he, Neil said, hey, you know, you can hold down B and run. I was like, what? And then I said, Look at that. He, Boom. He, roof. He didn't say okay. No. Yep. I ran. I ran so far away. Look at that. You you thought I was just going to do a flat a flat board, but no. I did a steepled roof. I didn't. <laughs> I had forgotten that you could do that from Breath of the Wild. One of the kids told me. Oh. <laughs> Oh wait, I need to I need to get the horse. What's this? It has a fitted with a roof. Yep, that's true. With little John, yeah, exactly. The world hasn't abandoned us. I'll never forget the kindness. Yeah. Alright. Um I have Hold on. Yeah, I gotta get my horse. I have one and a half wheels. I need to get more stamina, I know. Yeah. Oh. Huh. I have a reward available. Oh. Huh. Uh sure. Oh. Oh. Huh? All right, we're going to call it uh
I thought it was like a little horse, so we're gonna call it little little house. Little horse. Oh Little horse. <laughs> you focused on stamina. Little. Lil. Lil. Not like mine. Uh, I want to board that horse. Ass wipe, ass crack. And yeah, you, yeah. You, <laughs> yours are like ass wipe, ass crack. Mm. Asshole. And, sh and shithead. And shithead. Yeah, that's ne That's what oh. Neil uh, oh. names his horses. Well, ass wipe and shithead are, are from Breath of the Wild. Yeah. I have a I have Epona Dippy. <laughs> ass crack is new. And little horse. Dippy? <laughs> I thought that Dippy was from last game. We'd have to go back and watch the VOD. The VOD on YouTube. Look, if I'm playing the game, I'll name Ooh. them what I damn well Ooh. please. Oh. Huh? <laughs> Are you making Ooh. fun of my horses? Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, Jason. I'm not. I'm not really offended. All right, come on. Oh my God. No, I can't. Okay, I have to get off to attach you. Oh my goodness, they're falling. Oh my god, don't attach it to the... What is going on here? Why does it want to attach it to the wheel? You have, it, you have to put it up near it. Oh, we stop it. Freaking out. Nay. <laughs> I mean, look at this wonderful uh, thing I've built. Oh, look, a moose. I'm gonna head right for the moose. Look out, moose. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, stop falling out. Oi! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what did you? Oh, no, you can't just pick him up. You have to, you have to horse them there. They don't like it if you just carry them there. Oh, you built the vices. Oh, okay. Ah, I built a car. There she comes. Sounded like Mario. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
Her hair reminds me of the girl in Funky Winkerbean with crazy <laughs> Claire hair. The great fairy has returned to us. This, this is one of the greatest days of my life. Uh, the great fairy herself enjoyed my humble horn playing. What a day! What a divine presence. What splendor. I will remember this moment all my life. Oh. We can't hang around all day. We must return to the stable to share the good news. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh, 100 rupees. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Oopsie. That's left the old wallet pretty light, but there's no excuse to skip on our thanks. A clear con conscience is worth every yeah, rupee. Yeah. The Captain Maja is now at peace, but she wasn't the only great fairy shut away f in a flower bud. Oh. That's why the show must go on to the next fairy fairy, great fairy's hiding place. Oh yes, I'll be borrowing this horse so that I can get to the next destination. Oh. You will not be borrowing my horse, but it won't cause you any trouble. We'll do the responsible thing and return your steed to a stable boat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're the one who arranged those soothing sounds for me I would have liked to be released by someone bigger but yeah that's a, some hairdo there they are great <laughs> well a slim little lad like you is fine too I suppose It seems the world is not so corrupted as I thought. We thank you for opening my eyes. I can enhance your clothing. But of course, I require the necessary materials to do it. Ooh. With the power available to me, I can enhance your clothing a fair amount. Mm. Um, the problem is, is I don't really have anything really good. Uh, oh shit. I could definitely, I could, I could, I could do both of these. Oh, I see it gets a little, it gets a little star. Oh, I see. I need hy five Hyrulean basses. Oh, I see. She can do my hood, too. Okay. Well, this is already... Oh, okay. It doesn't... Okay. Highway robbery. Here I'm I'm freezing my ass off. Okay, let's Oh, I think that's what we wanted right there. That's what we were looking for. to go thanks for saving this isn't much of a reward but i hope it helps oh, thank Hi. you 
Well, it instantly cooked it. Crap. Crap. Oh, that scared me. Gotta go get my meat. I can never find the, the the clothes with the weather weather protection. They're like mysteriously always missing. <laughs> well no, you go you go in and buy them at towns in the cities. The more aggressive she gets at level clash. Oh my goodness. That does sound uh, a little excessive. Crappity crap crap crap. Oh, there's a moose. He's like, no. You see, <laughs> oh, Zab wants me to play arcade mode. What would you like me to play there, Zab? I think I found it. Galaga. All right. All right, well, hold on.
Finally. Finally, it is mine! Oh my. little horns now. Sonia! You were too late, Rauru. You took for granted the godlike power you had in your hands. Do you now see the potential you squandered? As for her, she is merely the first victim of your arrogance. You tried to control me, Rauru. And you will die knowing that you failed! I didn't realize he had a third eye. I feel like uh, Zelda has changed. She's gone to the past and changed time. All of this is Zelda's fault. <gasps> You're muted. You're muted, Neil. I would say, and this is not giving anything away because it happened at the beginning of the game. All of this is her fault because she disturbed that tune. Well, that, yeah, that, that too. That's true. That too. Yeah, this is all her fault. If she had left well enough alone, well, it's a predestined, it would be all right. It's a predestined paradox because he might not have been locked down there if she hadn't gone back in time. It's just, this is all very complicated. It's a very tiny-wimey. <laughs> All right, we're going to take a, an arcade mode break. Zab10101 wants me to play Galaga in... It was Galaga, right? <laughs> 
Arcade mode! Yeah. Is there a Hyrule Museum that has the artifacts of all the rest of the world? Like the British Museum? It was Galaga, right? Sam? Oh. <laughs> I know. He, earlier you were like, I, I'm going to get... Well, I hope y'all are prepared for the rest of the stream to be Galaga. <laughs> All right. All right. 167.470 is the high, high score I'm trying to beat. And yeah, I'm pretty good at Galaga. So we'll see. I may have just cursed myself by saying pretty good at Galaga. So, <laughs> so let's see. All right. Have a good one, Whiskey Smash. Thanks for, thanks for hanging out. <laughs> This is such a classic game. Sorry. Oh! <laughs> 
Man. Oh, I can't believe that. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> it's midnight. So, yeah, it is technically my birthday now. Thank you. <laughs> Happy birthday, sugar. <laughs> Thank you. Way older suddenly. Nice. No, you don't. <laughs> I look way older. <laughs> what time was I born? I was born around 9 p.m. Uh, but that would have been Central or 10, 10 p.m. Eastern. So, <laughs> Yeah, I, was, I actually had a really good run there for, uh, for a while. And then, yeah, I just started dying. I wonder if I would have gotten a free guy at, at 100,000. I think you do. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> that boy ain't right. I was very, very scheduled. My mom went into surgery at 8 o'clock in the morning, and I was born at 8.01. You were born at 8.01? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you like how I, I died, I, or I, I lost my double right, literally right before the challenge stage. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because I was I was doing really good in that I had never died. I had always had double ship and lost one up until uh, that level right there. <laughs> All right, let's try it again.
I just, I just decided to die. <laughs> I was like, eh. <laughs> I was like, no. <laughs> exactly three o'clock. It's okay. We can do this again. Shall we do it again? Thanks for the rain! Hey, Alpha Daddy Pup, how are you doing? <laughs> Welcome, everyone. <laughs> Thanks so much for the raid. Welcome. We're playing some arcade. We're playing some Galaga. What were you up to? Your life is strange? Nice. Another one. <laughs> All right. Thanks you so much, Alpha Daddy Pup, for the raid.
Dang it. <laughs> Thanks, Dark Passenger. Thank you so much. <laughs> I almost put my initials in there. <laughs> you might be safe tonight. You might be safe. 167 was a kick-ass score, I would say. <laughs> I think I at least got to stage 20 or something like that. I must have been ver doing really well that night. What, uh... When was that? 3-6-2022. So that's over a year ago. <laughs> All right, let's try it. One more time, you ready?
I messed that one up. Have a good one, Murray.
I can't believe I did that. Oh, 
<laughs> I can't believe I made it. <laughs> this is how the this is how the TRG Kai villain origin story happened. <laughs> Yeah, no, that was good. Level 20 on Galaga. That was pretty awesome. All right, let me update the high score. Yep, you just never know. Here I was saying, oh, man, 167, that's going to be tough. And boom, I beat it. And yes, it will have my birthday on it. 7 24, 2023. Boom. <laughs> this, yeah, I've got to have a montage of me warming up my fingers. <laughs> Hey, Wan Cub. How's it going? <laughs> then we'll become the new Tapper. Thing is, I, yeah, I can play Galaga. This, it, it's, I, I can really play Galaga for a while. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's play some Fry's Quest. <laughs> cool. Well, I love... Thank you for lurking. Thank you, everyone who lurks. Right. That should be updated. Let's see. Ready for battle. Oh, try it now, Jason. Yeah, if you played last game, now you can join in.
Time's up. Have fun watching the floor. All right. I'm going to take a quick break. I'll be right back. We're not satisfied until you're not satisfied. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for battle.
Welcome to Neil's Deals. Where else are you gonna go? Ready for action. You all feel Ready too for much. action. I need to raise these prices. Ready for action. Ready for action. Ready for action. Good luck. You'll certainly need it. I am back. I had to move the Korok because he was in my way. While I was playing. <laughs>
And Kai got the fry. There you go. That but looks like he needs still need four fries to level up. All right. Where were we? Oh yeah, that's right. We looked just looked at that. And so where is that? That's way up here. So there must be another one. Uh Beth of the Demon King. Yeah, it looks like there's another one along this ridge that way. All right, let's head towards that tower. Although I saw a shrine there. Hmm. Hmm. I guess I can remove this pin. Or is that the shrine? I don't think that's the shrine. Oh, it is the shrine. <laughs> Does that soften the blow? <laughs> but the shrine must be closer than we think, so we're going to go that way. It looks like it's far away. I don't know how we're going to get up there, but we'll figure it out. Onward and upward. Hey, Becca! How's it going? Thank you so much for the raid. Howdy, howdy. Hello, hello. Hey, Becca, how's it going? Welcome for the... Thank you for the raid. I almost said welcome for the raid. You're playing Hollow Knight. Nice! I played Hollow Knight. It was really fun. Although I probably didn't play it... I didn't... I don't know. I didn't 100% it or anything like that. I finished the main story, but people were telling me there was more to it. And I was like, on to the next game. We have too many games to complete. We got to keep going. <laughs> You're doing a randomizer. Okay, cool. Cool. I didn't know they had already done that, but of course, of course they have. I feel like if it's on the PC, they've hacked it somehow. I didn't get the full ending. You got the most of the main story okay well cool. thanks justin yeah <laughs> can be good well you know <laughs> that's cool that's cool well thank you so much for the raid um well we're playing um uh tears of the kingdom i'm basically kind of wandering uh this time i'm, I'm trying to find all these memories these um geoglyphs in the in the game and and kind of uncover more of the story behind the game and then uh and that's where the tears right i you know i kept thinking that the tears w were the little symbols that the the people are getting but but those are also tears <laughs> well there's too many tears in this game <laughs> how many tears can there be too many cooks too many cooks all right uh well, thank you again for the raid, and everyone should go give uh, the Becca, the Becca. <laughs> eh. Oh my God. Eh. <laughs> um, and I'm gonna play a, sh a clip real quick. <laughs> All right, everyone, go give her a follow. I haven't seen you since rookie training camp. Oh, you were playing. I am Captain Shepherd of the Rescue Oh, Corps. Pikmin Four. I don't remember. I played the first Pikmin. Did you order OG Pikmin. to get rid of those creatures all by yourself, Becca? Huh? Ochi's not supposed to be anyone but me. Guess that rookie training paid off after all, didn't it? You know, the first time I saw you in training, I had a feeling you'd make a top-notch dog trainer. Then a 99th gen rest. <laughs> so. So I played the f first Pikmin on my GameCube. 
me here. Uh, and I haven't, I haven't gone back and played two. I have two on the GameCube, and I have three, the three deluxe on the Switch, and I still need to get Hey Pikmin and four. So, um, so yeah, I'm eventually. That's kind of the next series I'm gonna play after. Um, after I finish Castlevania, I am on the last two Castlevania games, uh, and that's been twenty six games are have been uh, in the Castlevania series, and so I'm looking forward to finishing those and going back and finishing Pikmin. I know twenty six. It's taken me like two years to play them. Uh, there's so many of them. Uh, there's been collections on the Switch, and there was two collections on the Switch that helped, and then I bought a few on like the N64 and stuff like that. So, but it's been, that has been a quest and it's almost over. And actually the last, the last one. So we have, the, this is the last one. Well, here's the last two. Uh, Castlevania Lords of Shadow Mirror, of Fa Mirror of Fate on the 3DS. And then Lords of Shadow 2. Those are the last two I have to play. And so we're getting into the 2010s <laughs> with these games. But, but anyway, it's part of my stack. That's my stack of games. So I'm looking, I'm looking forward to it. Well, thanks. Thanks again for the raid. We're going to continue our quest. We're, we were heading towards that shrine. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking forward to uh, finishing Castlevania. <laughs> it's going to be a big, it's been kind of a long quest. I mean, it's kind of like Legend of Zelda. So one of the first series I streamed here, well, the first series I streamed was Paper Mario, which I played all the Paper Mario games and then ended with Origami King, which came out. And then I did all the Metroid games, which, you know, Metroid Dread then came out. And then I have, um, I played all the Legend of Zelda games, right? More boobs in the next Castlevania. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to happen there, Justin. Stuck on echoes. Hmm. This looks This looks suspicious. Can I Can I do that? Oh, fire! Oh, nice. Some meat. I thought maybe I could... I could... I could... That was opening up a cave. I guess not. <laughs> and corruption. Those are pretty good ones, I will say. What I would say... What was the one that I played... On the DS, Justin. Federation Force. That was the weakest. Come on. Okay, I guess. Can I climb this? I didn't think so. Hmm. <laughs> oh, thanks for following. All right, this. Where's my, where's my flint? Got plenty of flint. Is it because it's not metal? I was going to say it is metal. Oh, you played them on the GameCube. I bought the um, Metroid Prime Trilogy on the Wii. Was it the Wii? 
Yeah. So I played it on the Wii U, actually. Be careful with melting the ice. Yeah. Because I have unfrozen enemies. You have unfrozen enemies in there? Yes. <laughs> it was one of those lizards. I hate the lizards. Yeah, I know what you're about. Do not like them. Do not like the lizards. Thanks for the lurk, and thanks again for the raid. Oh, this is, it's been great. I've, I've really been enjoying it. Am I to get there from, can I get there from below? Take a look. You might have to. Oh, you know what I should do? I know what I should do. Here, let's go back. Had an idea. Where's my pine cone? Why do I <laughs> deny? I don't I don't know that I have. He could still do it. <laughs> He just wants to see me panic. Because I don't want anyone else to experience that. It's it's like a tease. Boom. I knew I could do it. <laughs> yeah, I, so I've played all of them. Uh, you should try Spirit Tracks. Not so fun. <laughs> Did I did I end up saying that was my my least favorite was Spirit Tracks? You said it to me. Yeah, I think Spirit Tracks. It almost bro broke my spirit. Uh, <laughs> Four Swords. I didn't actually play Four Swords because I felt like it would have been better multiplayer. Yeah, don't you you can skip that one. Okay, this looks pretty easy. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. So the only thing I didn't like on Spirit Tracks, I'll say this. Uh, <clears throat> that's true. I, I didn't mind Sp Phantom Hourglass. Um, what I didn't like with Spirit Tracks was the controls. There is a certain point where you have to control uh, another character. And uh, that character can be difficult to control. Um <laughs> And like it, they they expected you to do too much simultaneously is what I feel, and that was my that was my my problem with it. Overall, like story wise, I didn't mind. I kind of liked riding on the train and and stuff like that. Uh, it was just uh. Oh shit. Whoa. Guess I should have attached it before. Before, <laughs> before I. Oh, come on, just hit it. Activate it. Shoot it with an arrow. Oh, there you go.
<laughs> it works great. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Like it doesn't want me to be. do that. That was hilarious. <laughs> Being stuck on train tracks instead of soy that's true but i think i feel like they were doing that just to kind of be a mechanic which maybe that was just a mechanic we didn't really care about okay so i felt like my uh I felt like my uh, idea was a sound idea, by the way. I felt like my execution wasn't all that great. I think it needs to probably be more off-center than it. Yeah. Boom. Or you might try putting it on the edge. Barely touched it. <laughs> that was like uh that was like some price is right rangefinder shit there. <laughs> yes! <laughs> that was awesome. Oh that's right, I forgot about the half train people. <laughs> I forgot about that. <clears throat> was there a Raru in the Spirit Tracks and he was half trained? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> where does where does Spirit Tracks fit in this timeline? Oops, I'm sorry. I'm watching this again. Okay. I feel like there's on the other side of whatever the hell that is. Hmm. Yeah. The shite. Can we make that? I don't think we can make that. That seems like a long way away. Let's head let's head back to the tower. And maybe the tower can help us get there. Wait, what am I doing? I can teleport to the tower. I forget, you know, well, Justin knows this. I forget about fast travel constantly. Constantly. Constantly forget about fast travel. That's okay, Link. We're going to go up in the air where it's even colder. Don't you worry. That's what we want right there. 
No, that's not the one we want. Gotta be it. Gotta be another one. Let's head for. Let's head over here. Freezing to death. Yeah, I see. I've got cold resistance. Let's get on that one on the bottom. It's not going to end well. Okay, this is yeah, uh, this is the area we've already beat. Great if there weren't so many clouds. Why does the sky have to have clouds? Well, it, it doesn't, but that would mean that there would be no water and no light. <laughs> I know, they should have tied it to Skyward Sword. In fact, I think a lot of people were expecting that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it is a good thing. I kind of do, so it, it always frightens me to be up this high. But it does not. <laughs> Shit, <laughs> fucking A. Where are we going? All right, this isn't that. That that? What did I pin that? To jump on that belly so bad. Oh shit, I might actually do it. Why am I not killing him? <laughs> yes! Yes! That was awesome. He didn't even know what the fuck was going on. And I had already half killed him. <laughs> that was awesome.
in the silent room. Yes, in Cyrus Sword. I do remember that. They looked very similar to those. Yes. Hmm, could be. I I did I did enjoy beating his butt. Ooh, this looks like a very rapid ripper here. Like, where the hell am I now? That was fun. <laughs> the, 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 the Highland hero, Hylian hero, falls from the sky and beats that whatever that was to death. South of the the flight range I remember the flight range why isn't it pushing me up I wanted it to push me up I wanted it to push me up into the sky probably only pushes you as high as that yeah yeah exactly I'm probably at the height that I can be um Okay, so it looks like it's west of that lake. Over here. But that would be east of that lake, not west. East of that lake. Heading the right way. Yes. I don't know if it's like over there.
Get it. <laughs> Holy shit, I am going to kill it. One rupee. No, it is not. Crap. What are you looking for? There's supposed to be like a tier thing here. Let's look at the map again. It's kind of... Kind of... Oh, maybe that's what that pin is. There's a shrine. Let's go that way. Why can't I go through this? That thing is really goddamn picky. <laughs> I mean, it is super picky. It's fucking stupid picky. set the rounds on fire. They're not connected. Yeah, I thought they were connected. It's 
even better though is coming out of that and then hurting yourself on it. <laughs> I just quit walking the wrong direction. A launching device. Alrighty. <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant to do. Is this so I can get in it? things. What if I... safe. So what was, so what was that, uh, tell us more about that. We don't need them on the sides. <laughs> Was did they like do an e a video EEG to try and detect your seizures and stuff like that? Why do I not know this? Your head detect during the seizures. Ah. Oh, a lobotomy sounds bad, but maybe if it's pinpointed, it wouldn't be so bad. Inconclusive. Hmm. Be 
too high. Okay, so, alright, so it's getting late. I'm trying to, I want to at least find where this other gear was. Just to cut away the thing. Interesting. Yeah, that's definitely something I have never, uh, have no experience with or have known anyone about it. Um, a friend of mine had colon cancer, and I've learned a, I've learned a lot about colon cancer uh, through him. <laughs> that's awesome. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> Murdered. What does an octo balloon do? <laughs> Basically nothing. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh he didn't do much. That was pretty awesome. I killed several of them by dropping that rock down. Yeah. Nice, Justin. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's a, t yeah, I could understand that being a t difficult decision because you don't know what side effects there can be, right? in this list. Why would I attach meat to my arrow? have to hide in here for the rest of our lives 
It'll be just the two of us locked in here forever at this rate. Mm -hmm. Hey, it seems like I it got quiet out there all of a sudden. Oh. Okay. Oh. Uh, how do I open the door? <laughs> oh, I see. I, I may have a torch. Well, I have the stick. We'll smoke them out. Well, why can't I just open the door? What are you saying? Why would anyone help us? This place is crawling with monsters. Monsters? I can't hear them anymore. Come on, Jergo. <laughs> you defeated the monsters? Thanks for helping us. Didn't you hear the giant explosion? We took a break in here, vacant this vacant house to get away from the cold. Yeah. Uh, give me give me like a thousand rupees. Ah. Uh, cold cold uh, resistance. <laughs> hey, is it uh? Twitchy Zandy, welcome. Let me know if I said that wrong. Uh, hey, you know anything about shield surfing? Get around with like a shield. First, you hold up your shield, then you jump on it. If you got some. Uh, ready, sh ready shield, jump ride. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. You're right. Thanks. I don't. I don't need your. I don't need your shield. All right. Cool. Well, welcome. All right. I thought there was something around here. Seems like it's this way. I marked something, and it, it looks like there's another here. I'm doing well, thank you. I was hoping to have gotten more of this done today, but thought I could find more Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> if you strap a Volt Fruit, does it do anything? It does nothing. That's no, you have to use a shock fruit. Shock fruit? A volt fruit you cook to give you electric resistance. Oh, okay. A shock fruit, which is that yellow one that's like three down on the left. That's Dazzle Fruit. Yeah, you've got 27 Shock Fruit. Saw it? Hmm? You saw it? Yeah. Oh, Shock Fruit. Oh, I see. That one. Yeah. yeah. It's the lemon. Oh, shit. Here, I'm, I'm attacking him with my stick, which is really good. Alright, let's not use this. This is a terrible weapon. Oh, fuck! There, he didn't like that. Uh. Beep, beep. 
Didn't you, when you first, um, when you first started streaming, you didn't have a beard. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> strapped in you mean you you looked slightly disheveled with a bunch of wires hooked to you yeah. all the time you look like uh, so i had a sleep study and you look like when i had a sleep study i had the easy sleep <laughs> study it was just like yeah you had a sleep study in the house you didn't yeah. have to go anywhere there it is i found it it is right there all right let's find Congratulations. Wires were a fashion statement back then. Back in the 2010s, we like to hook up wires to our face. Yeah, mine wasn't there. Mine wasn't in a hospital. It was at a sleep study center. I've had him had it like three times or so. Neil got to do his sleep. We both have CPAPs and I, I swear by it. I can't, I can't sleep without mine now. Um. I can sleep anywhere at any time. Oh, no, I've run out of. Oh well, she gave me that cult, that elixir. At least give me enough time to find the tear. Yeah, I mean, it, it, I, well, it was funny because it was when me and Neil were dating and he was like, you, you do know that, uh, you stop breathing while you're asleep. And I'm like, no, I'm asleep. How would I know that? He had, he would make the sound, the little slight squeal of Darth Vader's helmet closing and stop breathing. <laughs> like that? <laughs> Like a, a seal. That that weird little ee, ee kind of sound. <laughs> oh, sleep studies two thousand. Yeah, that's pretty expensive. Yeah, we both have pretty good insurance. So, all right, let's watch this tier. And this is probably where we'll stop. It's one thirty in the morning. Although I did take my my birthday off from work, so I don't work tomorrow. Yeah. Sleep talk. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, it's tomorrow. Well, I guess it's technically today. As I thought. This is not the world I know. A time so far back in the past, it's become legend. So it's true. This is really the era of Hyrule's founding? Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone and are able to manipulate time, then your story makes sense. Oh, I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Rauru? I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. You're part goat? <laughs> oh, I see. In any case, Zelda, you had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. Yes. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
Now, Zelda, dear. Oh, you don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle, hmm? No, uh, I... We'll tell everyone that you're a distant relative of ours. <laughs> it is true, after all. <laughs> we'll get you fresh clothes, too. I'm sure an answer will come to you. Wisdom takes time. Oh. I don't know what to say. Hmm, I wonder. Minoru, she may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Yes. She knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. Yeah, that's a good point, Justin. There's no reason why they couldn't have just shown you these in order as you, like, find them, right? <laughs> yeah, they have an order to them here. Like, I, don't, I haven't even seen the first one. But there's no way to, to tell, like, where they are. Like, I have... I have this map of them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There seems to be more than 11 here. There's 18. Hmm. Oh, it says Tear of the Dragon 10. The Awakening. Okay, so some of these are just... I see. Tear of the Dragon 1. Okay. Tear of the Dragon 2. Tear of the Dragon 3. Tear of the Dragon 4. Okay, so yeah, I kind of saw, I did kind of watch that one out of order. And okay, okay. Yeah, I guess you're right. When I looked at this map, they're probably in order like along the wall. And then you're probably, yeah, that's too much work. <laughs> All right, let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two. Is there another one? Another one. Another tier. Oh no, it's further closer to the castle. Oh, wait, one that's of those this. You have. That's that one. So I have all of the one, two, three. Then there's one here. There's one. Uh, and then there's one down there. There's one in that zone you don't have. Uh. Oh no, there's four. All right, let's just say, let's take all of them up here to the left. One, two, three, four, five. And then we look at the map. One, two, three, four. Right. One, two. Got these three. And then there's one here. Did I miss one down here then? You've gone the wrong way. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, you're right. Uh, I have I have right missed there. one at the end of this river. Oh yeah. So yeah, there's one right here that we need to go go get. So I'm just gonna what the, that stamp was terrible. I need a tear. Why wouldn't they put a tear stamp? <laughs> I need like a little tear. All right, we're just going to put a star. Actually, here. Please stamp. There. And I'm going to we'll delete that one. 
All right. <laughs> In the middle of nowhere. I guess I can, I can, uh, I can teleport. I'll, I'll just do that. <laughs> oh man. Thanks everyone for being here. I stream every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 9.30 p.m. Eastern, and on Saturdays at 3 p.m. Eastern. I'll be back tomorrow night. My birthday! I guess we'll have a birthday stream. It'll just be a normal stream. Maybe I'll put little balloons on my icon or something. But uh, <laughs> uh, if you can't be here live, go check out everything over at YouTube. Uh, go give me a follow there. Hey, Dallas Gorgi. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, thank you to all these names over here. Thank you, subscribers. Didn't do it without you. Thanks for uh, helping subsidize my video game habit. <laughs> the bur wonderful birthday sleep. <laughs> I will have that, Zab. Well, that's why I took the day off from work so I can sleep in. I don't have to wake up by alarm. That's actually kind of one of the, like advantages of, of taking the day off from work. I don't have to wake up early <laughs> and I can sleep in. Uh, thank you, subscribers. Aren't you? They get all those emotes that flute right there in ad free viewing. Your original artist. <laughs> yeah, I mean, look, I bought a P I bought a PSP. Actually, Neil bought this for me. So I handed him that that uh, five bits you gave me and he turned it into an empire that allowed me to him to buy this PSP for me right uh, yeah he, through through good investment <laughs> I don't think any investment turns that or, or <laughs> what, turns is that, what is that what is five, five bits five, five cents five cents yeah it's a nickel didn't it, isn't that something from Mary Poppins? You gotta save your pennies. Tuppence. Tuppets. Tuppens. I can't remember that song. <laughs> it's, it's you you feed the birds, tuppets a bag. Tuppens a bag. Is, That's true. Is, it was all in two pence. It was all NFTs and Do Dogecoin. That's true. It was. It was it was Neil Coin. I mean shit, the, all of all of that the bottom fell out of that a year ago. Yeah, yeah. No, it was all investments in AI companies. That's what it was. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Obviously, you haven't looked at my E-Trade account. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If you want to hang out on the Discord, I just threw an, uh, an invite link over there. And then I also threw in the raid messages. I'm going to copy that raid message myself. And I'm going to see who else is on right now that we could raid sunday night is an interesting night i don't know who might be i think he was on earlier super nimbo is on Let's see what he's doing he is playing mega man x command mission aka the rpg one I think we should do that. I like Super Nimbo. Thank you so much for being here and uh, hope to see you back here tomorrow for my birthday. Birthday present. Show up tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks again, everyone. Hope you have a great week. See you next time. Bye.